to now. I'm uh, joined by Stuart. Hi, good afternoon now. Uh, my name is Stuart Hill. I'm the technical sales manager here at Hepco Motion. Thanks, Stuart. And uh, today we're looking at DTS, um, DTS technology. And when I think about sort of product handling and moving a product from point A to point B, you know, very much the sort of the, the long-term solution has been a linear motion with a, an actuator or guide, for example. How does this technology differ? Well, essentially, uh, the DTS allows for continual motion. There is no linear transfer. It is a continual ring and track system based upon HEPCO technology. Um, and it is completely bespoke to customers' requirements. You can have the system as a standard oval with 180 degree turns or rectangular systems that will allow you almost infinite widths and lengths. Um, it basically creates the heart of any customer's machine. Yeah, okay, and you mentioned that, and, and you know, the example we're looking at here, we've got a, uh, a industrial robot which is picking and placing. Um, you know, when the designer is sort of thinking about putting this into this, to their machine, you know, what are, what are the considerations? Where, where does it fit? Um, what, are the, what about the ancillary extras such as the robots and pick and place systems? Well, essentially, we have a number of different sizes of DTS that will allow from carrying a few grams all the way up to 100 kilograms. Um, our new DTS Plus 76 allows for these very heavy loads. Um, you can have things like car automotive parts and, and assemblies. Um, from, from our point of view, you can have a wide range of carriage pitches to allow customers' own designs and what suits their needs. No, fantastic. And, and when you talk about those loads and speeds, you know, performance is very much a, a common theme. Um, you know, what, what are we talking about with these types of systems? Um, speeds of up to two meters a second are easily possible. That will allow high throughput of customers' product. So 120 parts per minute is easily achievable. Okay. And, uh, you know, this example is working with an industrial robot and Clearly, you need a degree of accuracy and repeatability for those types of, of, of applications. What, what can this achieve? Um, the sort of accuracy that can be achieved with the DTS once in combination with our specific carriage locking system is plus or minus 50 microns. Um, it's helped also by a pneumatic actuator that allows high speed locking and unlocking of the carriages. Fantastic. And, uh, Obviously, the, these types of systems are designed for 24-7 operation. Yep. Um, what's the sort of maintenance requirements for a, uh, this type of system? Essentially, the DTS requires zero maintenance. Um, it has lubricators on the carriages to provide oil into the guidance. And added to that, with our patented bleed lubrication technology, that will allow continual greasing of the slide system and no maintenance for customers in the life of the system. Fantastic. Thanks, Stuart. Shall we go and take a look at the HGS? Let's go. Okay, so Stuart, we're now over with our HGS heavy duty gantry system. And our viewers may be looking at this technology and wondering, well, why can't I use an overhead crane or maybe a large industrial robot? Okay, well, that's a good question. Um, essentially, uh, an industrial crane and a robot, they have their place in, in applications. Um, but cranes inherently, um, even though they'll give you long strokes, they are generally low speed uh, and low accuracy, whereas a HEPCO gantry can offer both high speed, high accuracy and high payloads. Um, in terms of robots, um, robots can cover high payloads and high accuracy, but their envelope is quite limited. Whereas HEPCO gantry system as, as this, we can offer very long strokes, almost unlimited in terms of the main running axis. Okay, so effectively what we're looking at here is best of both worlds. Yep. Um, what sort of um, performance can we get out of these systems? I mean, what type of payloads, what type of speeds are these systems capable of running at? Well, in, in its configurations, you can have speeds of over two meters a second uh, and payloads of up to 250 kilos are, are easily achievable depending upon the configuration that you choose for our gantries. Now, that's interesting. You mentioned configuration and I'm looking at this and, and it's quite a, an advanced piece of engineering. There's all clearly a lot of design work that goes into this. Um, how do our customers go about specifying or having one of these systems specified? So HEPCO can provide the support from basically concept of, of the overall design all the way through to supply and installation. Um, we offer a unique service using our own system configurator which is led 
by technical engineers from my team and also from the sales side where we can have an online meeting with the customer and discuss their requirements. And from there, we can configure a system in real time and provide a quote and a CAD file. This cuts down time in terms of the overall concept of the design from days down to hours. So essentially, we're taking all the difficult, hard legwork out of, of this process for the customers. Um, and, and I'm just looking at this, and you know, you mentioned about the very high payloads that these could potentially deliver. And, you know, of course, there's got to be a safety element with, with that. So what, what have we built into these designs? So in, in terms of the overall design, the, the basis is from the heavy duty slide system that HEPCO have designed and supplied for tens of years. We have essentially turbocharged that and we now have a numerous safety features from a Z-axis brake to catches that will stop the X-axis from falling all the way down to shock absorbers and buffers that will uh, allow end protection of the systems.